Gukesh just finished his game against uh, Hikaru Nakamura. It was a draw. Um, seems like it was a somewhat calmer game. Uh, you were pressing a little bit with White, but it never left uh, the quality like it was never something extremely good for you. Um, so how do you feel about this game? Uh, yeah, it was uh, a pretty calm game. Uh, I mean, I, I thought I had some some uh, slight pull in the opening, but but yeah, this knight c8 and uh, knight c8 idea was very strong, and uh, I couldn't really see anything uh, anything for white there. And uh, after all the trades happened, I I thought it might be a bit uh, unpleasant for me, but I figured if I just uh, stay and not do anything, it should just be a draw. So. How do you assess your tournament so far? Um, yeah, pretty good. I, I played some good games. But yeah, uh, still a uh, lot, of, lot of games left. Well, uh, your compatriot Vidit is playing some crazy chess here <laughs> in the tournament. Uh, do you follow his games uh, during, the, during the time when you play or maybe after the game, after the game day? Uh, during the game, I'm not really following all the games in detail, but of course, uh, I mean, all the games I check later, so, uh, yeah. Well, uh, there are so many Indians uh, here. You have a new generation that uh, is really coming up. Um, how do you feel about that? And when do you think we'll see the world champion uh, from India next one after Anand? Uh, yeah, it's nice that uh, there are a lot of strong players in India and also uh, a lot of fans and a lot of supporters. And about uh, when we'll see the next world champion, I mean, it's very hard to make uh, that kind of prediction. So, yeah, let's see. Will it be this cycle? Uh, I don't know. Let's see. <laughs> All right. Thank you. And uh, see you next time.